So we're here at the Women in Horror Film Festival. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about your name and the project that you're working on? Yes, my name is Rakefit Abergel, and I'm working. I um, my film Jackson Love is here. It's a short. It's going to be in the thriller block tomorrow. Okay. And it's my first film that I've produced and wrote and. It's my first film festival that I've had a movie in, so. <laughs> now, you're normally an actor, correct? Yes. Uh, so, so this is your first branching into writing and, and producing your own stuff? Correct, yes. I, I mean, I, I like acting, but it's kind of fun being the boss also. That's always fun, <laughs> although it's expensive. <laughs> <laughs> so what brought you here to the Women in Horror Film Festival? Um, well, actually, a friend of mine is friends with someone who is one of the judges, okay. and she said, your film would be so good for the Send it to her. So I sent it to her and she was like, oh my God, you have to submit it. So I submitted it and I got in and I'm just happy. It's my first festival, I had to be here. I spent a lot of money to come here, but like, <laughs> it was good. Well, that's pretty exciting for your first film to make it uh, to be like here in the Women in Horror Film Festival. Cause yes. I know there was a lot of submissions and not everything's gonna be showing, so. I mean, yeah. I'm glad, I hope I, I hope not everything got in. <laughs> like, we'll take anything, it's fine. It's just the good want. stuff. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, yeah. Well, I mean, it's cool cause it's the first year of the festival. So like when this is a huge festival, Festival in like five years, maybe like when it's really ramped up, I'll be like, "Well, I was at the first one, so yeah. that's cool." Yeah. Talking to Brian. <laughs> <laughs> so, is there anything this weekend that you're ex extremely excited for, or what? What? What most excites you about the weekend? Here? Um, I'm well. I'm I'm really nervous about seeing my film with an audience. Okay. I haven't seen it with an audience on first a big time. screen, so that's. I, I hope everybody doesn't boo and walk out or something. Um, as far as excitement, I know it's weird to say because it's not even really the festival, but I want to go see the Walking Dead stuff. Yeah. I really just came here. I just want to see the Walking Dead stuff. I want to see the town and the thing, and I want to eat at Norman Reedus' restaurant, and if That's he's awesome. there, I'll die. I'll die. I'll die. If you go say hi to Nikki, she's awesome. She sits behind the bar. She's, oh, yeah? She's awesome people. So I can throw your name around. Totally. Be like, be like yeah, yeah. Brian. Brian. Tell her Brian, Brian from Rainy Season. She okay. probably know from that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Hey, yeah. see, Georgia. <laughs> Gotta love Georgia. I've never been to Georgia. First time. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah, so I like it. Where are you from? I'm from LA. Okay. Born and raised, and um, I've never been to Georgia before. <laughs> I don't know, but like, I love The Walking Dead, and I'm excited about. I'm not okay. I hate horror films. Really? I do. I mean, you, one. I, know. I feel like you can't say that here. I know. <laughs> That's not, like coming to Atlanta and be like, where's the Pepsi? It's not This is Coke you're Town. Right, you're right. <laughs> and I like Coke better, to be honest. But I don't hate horror films because they're bad. I hate them because they're scary. And I'm a... <laughs> you can say it. I'm a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't do well with horror movies. And I don't know why I made one. It, it wasn't intended to be one. And it kind of became one. So now I'm going to all these horror film festivals and... I don't know why it's terrible because it's like li literally I can't watch them and I'm here alone and it's like woodsy out here. It's like Blair Witch out there. <laughs> it's kind of a, they, they chose this venue for the creepy. Did they? They did. Because they it is. It's did. super <laughs> fucking creepy. You are in the middle of the woods it's... all by yourself. Okay, you're coming to my room with me right now. <laughs> Just to protect me. My girlfriend would not appreciate. Protect, protect. You can stand outside the door. Fair. I will. Outside I will do the that door. Out, outside, outside the door. I, I love you, babe. <laughs> totally outside the door. I'm not. I don't do that. That's not my thing. That's not my thing. I just need protection from all the zombies and the horrible. This is Philip. He's one of the other filmmakers. Philip, come on in here. Come in here. He's taking <laughs> pictures and he's so cute. Look how cute he is. Uh, so we're this here with like cute Philip right also here. at the Women in Horror Film Festival. Can you tell us a little bit about the film you did? Or? So it's a short film based on a Stephen King short uh, short story. Nice. Uh, it's called Suffer. Okay. Uh, it's about a crazy teacher that uh, goes berserk and uh, kills all her uh, students. I'm a teacher. Yeah. Did I mention that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, is this is this in inspiration? I, mean, I want to see this so bad. I can't. Our films are in the same block tomorrow. Okay. Yeah. Nice. So we're very excited, and we came from the 
airport together. That's right. Well, yeah. I will definitely be excited to see that. I mean, I also starred in a, a Stephen King film that Vanessa did, Rainy Season, so uh, based off of his shorts. Stephen King's one of the masters, so all praise there. Um, can you tell us uh, what, what's most exciting about the Women in Horror Film Festival here for you? Uh, you know what, I think just like meeting fellow filmmakers, uh, seeing what people are up to, what they did, just connecting, and you know, it's like a community. You just want to kind of connect and uh, just, you know, see other people's films and learn about them and what they're up to. And yeah. So cool. I think it's that's cool. the best thing. It's really cool meeting other filmmakers. Absolutely, I yeah. Think. Yeah. <laughs> so um, how has the festival been for you so far? Uh, so far, so good. I just got here. <laughs> okay. We so like just got here. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So off to a good start. Yeah. yeah. To a good start. You know what? The venue's pretty cool. Uh, feels like I'm in a high school retreat of some sort. <laughs> I feel like we're gonna be doing like group breakout sessions. We're all gonna introduce like, ourselves. Heads up, Seven Up or something. Yeah. So yeah, it's a cool venue. Nice. You know, nice. Cool people. Cool. Fun event. So uh, we know about the films that you guys have in the festival. Is there anything else that you're working on in the future? I'm doing a, uh, a remake of The Godfather. Oh, nice. No, you're just, not. <laughs> like, oh, my what? God. I was like, that's awesome. <laughs> that's very ambitious like, of you. No. Like, I'm just writing it at home by myself. Yeah, it's fine. I don't think anyone's going to let me I do it. Christopher <laughs> Coppola did a... His, uh, he didn't do such a great job, job really. Like, <laughs> no. it, it does need a remake. Yeah. It's horrible. No, you know, I'm working on a, a micro budget feature I want to do. Okay. Uh, and also writing a web series. Uh, so. Both you know. starring a really funny Jewish girl. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> who happens to be a teacher who wrote an accidental horror film. An accidental <laughs> horror film. That's exactly what it That's is. Exactly right. It is. So if I, any, uh, anybody wants to uh, invest and support, you know. Send money, yeah, right? That's right? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Awesome. Well, yeah, guys, it was great talking to you. Yeah.